What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. So we're gonna get right back into it, right where we left off. Oh no. Barry? Why isn't he inside? Oh god! Oh god! Oh no, 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 Barry, run. Run, Barry. Christ. Barry! He made it inside, Wake. He's okay. Yeah, but he's still cut off from us. The storefront's blocked. Come on, Wake. Let's go around. We can meet him in the back. Oh, poor Barry. Okay. I swear, I don't remember if he makes it or not. There's just, I don't remember like almost any of this so far. I don't remember if he makes it or not, but I swear that man better make it. Trust no one in the dark. I love how those messages are just like everywhere all over town. Should be well, waiting for us in the backyard. Get the hell down, or I'll call the sheriff. Oh, hi, Doc. I've got it. Don't worry about it. Sarah, about time <laughs> somebody showed up. All the shooting in the air is idiotic. One of these days, they'll kill somebody. And over deer fest. I know. Go back to bed. Yeah, yeah. It's just deer fest, buddy. Look, this town can't take this. It's me they want. The sooner I get out of here, the sooner you can all get back to life as usual. I hope you're right. Come on. Let me get this door open. Wait, you got the keys to the bookstore? Perks of being the sheriff. A girl needs to get around. <laughs> she just has like a single key that's like a master key to everything. Like everybody's house, all their closets, their shed. Yeah, no big deal. <laughs> they're really taking advantage of your presence here, Wake. I heard they're selling a lot of your Alex Casey books. Right now, I'm not a big fan of my own writing. <laughs> That's fair, though. Oh, jeez. I turned a little too quickly. Okay. All right, Cynthia's work. Cynthia Weaver worked hard, following her obsessive rituals, sometimes fighting them, always giving in to them in the end. She haunted the halls of Bright Falls' abandoned power plant. She marked her caches with light-sensitive paint that could only be seen by eyes that had been touched by darkness and saved by light like she'd been. She was preparing defenses and supply lines for the war she knew would come. The war between the forces of light and darkness. It's been Weaver. It's been Cynthia this entire time. She's been our savior, leaving the caches behind. I don't see Barry. Nice. Look, Wake, maybe that's him. That's the way to the chopper. Well, hopefully that is him. Grab this, since I just happened to notice it. Alright, let's go. Man, all this deer fest stuff is just, I mean, they're they're ready for this thing. Seal firearms are prohibited in this facility. I'm gonna give Pastor Howard a piece of my mind about this lock. Oh, I told him to get it fixed. Here they come. Oh, great. Oh, let's take a break. Survive the assault. Come on. 
Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I thought I'd gotten okay, flare gun open. ammo. Let's go, wake. Oh, you know what? I may have gotten flare gun ammo, but I don't have a flare gun, so... Dark Presence hunts Wake. To be free, the Dark Presence needed the writer to finish the story. Again and again, the story let it get frustratingly close to the writer without letting it capture him. It was bound by the events depicted in the manuscript, but it could pursue the writer indirectly, put others on the task, and stop those who would help him. It took over everything in its path, made them its puppets, and sent them after Alan Wake. So it can't directly capture me, but that's why it's sending so many people after me. That's why all of a sudden all of this crap is happening. There. We'll have to go through the basement to get to the parking lot. Yeah, there's no way going through the crypt will turn out to be a bad idea. <laughs> I guess I'm leading. Come on, sir. You got this. Nice. See, I knew you could do it. All right. Get the hell out of here. Oh shit. Oh, dude, I saw him right, right at the last second. Look at him. You didn't like that one? A tough audience. <laughs> well, I got plenty more. What? What are the Christmas lights for? Protection, man. Like garlic against vampires. Vampires. <laughs> the helicopter's just across the parking lot and up the hill. Come on. Freaking Loveberry. Okay. Alrighty, guys. Boys, this is crazy. Oh my god, I'm so glad Barry's alive. I s and I swear, I swear, if they kill him, I'm gonna be so pissed. I don't remember if he survives or not. General store is now my favorite place in the entire world. Is that what happened? Lamp? It's like a superpower. I can just look at one of those things and they die. It's my flaming eye of Mordor. <laughs> I wish I didn't say that. <laughs> hey, I want a headlamp. Last one. Bastard. <laughs> Alice had screamed until she had no voice left to scream. Around her, the darkness was alive. It was cold and wet and malevolent and without end. She was a prisoner, trapped in the dark place. The terror would have burned her mind out, but one thing made her hang on. She could sense Alan in the dark. She could hear him. She could see the words he was writing as flickering shadows. He sensed her, too. He was trying to work his way to her. Oh, man. That poor woman being, you know, having such a surreal, like, sense of fear when it came, comes to the darkness and to just be trapped in it. When someone throws a damn school bus at your head and you're about to take a helicopter ride with someone who may or may not have a pilot's license, you're cleared for departure to Night Springs. <laughs> no finishing. Come on. I was wondering why they were just standing there. Oh, come on.
Gone. Okay. Oh, I'm never gonna get used to this. <laughs> Fire department. The helicopter's just up ahead. I'll need a while to prep for takeoff. Don't take too long. I want to get out of here. Oh, well, that's a pretty badass freaking helicopter. Okay. Oh, so they both get to get in the chopper, but I have to hold down the fort. Oh, freaking great. Jesus, get the hell out of me. Keep these lights on. Like this. Right. The city's a war zone. King Kong, mutant alligator. 
years, and Alex Casey shoots the place up every weekend. Look, I never even carried a gun until a couple of days ago. Well, my dad used to be a cop there. Tells some pretty wild stories. Stuff like this? No, no, just normal bad stuff. Kind of like your books, Wake. I used to tease dad that he was just like Alex Casey. You've read me. Oh, sure. You're a pretty good writer. A little heavy on the metaphors, maybe. Nobody's ever said that before. We're coming up on the power plant. See the lit building over there? And that's the dam further up the river. I can't land here. I'll take her down the road across the river. Just get me there, Sheriff. boys um, that's where i'm gonna go and end it for tonight so thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed don't forget to like subscribe hit that bell button i'll see you guys in the next one peace bye